How will Jupiter and Capricorn speak to you and your sign? Find out at NadiaShaw.com. Hello, fabulous Virgo. Welcome to your horoscope for the month of December 2019. Looking at life and love. I am your astrologer, Nadia Shaw. Thank you for being here. What an amazing month it is. We have an active and fabulous sky playing out for us right now. And it is right in the middle of the month, right around the 12th is when we are going to have this month's full moon. This full moon will be taking place at the very top of your sky. And part of what makes this full moon distinctive is that it is connecting with Neptune in a connection of tension. And what this represents is a lack of clarity where it comes to what is being fulfilled for you at this time. For some, this can represent a sense of accomplishment that doesn't quite meet the essential desires you had, maybe in some way ends up feeling not as fulfilling as you had hoped. For others, this can be a time where, and I'm sorry to say, but sometimes with this, there can also be a sense of uh, disappointment as well. Perhaps it is that someone who is an authority figure to you is not being very straightforward or not being clear with you as much as you would like. Sometimes that's unintentional, but sometimes it can feel intentional as well. And sometimes with this, it can be more of a realization as to what isn't working. Now that can actually be incredibly valuable as part of refining your way forward towards a success that is going to be deeply meaningful to you. Now, regardless of what happens, under the light of this incredible full moon, we are going to have Mars speaking in supreme harmony with Neptune. And that tells me a couple of things. One is it is in conversations with people one-on-one -on -one that you in some way are restored to wisdom, are restored to power. In fact, this is that sense of seeing things from a perspective of spirit, from a perspective of wisdom and meaning and purpose that ends up helping you to understand best how to empower yourself to navigate forward during this time. Regardless of what happens, it is an important time that ultimately aligns you with a higher, more loving vision for your life. Now, the big news this month, of course, is Jupiter. Right around the second of the month, Jupiter is gonna change signs, moving into fellow Earth sign Capricorn. There are Jupiter specials on my website. There's going to be a Jupiter special in the first days of December on my YouTube channel as well, so be on the lookout for that. However, this is a part of the sky for you. This fellow Earth sign part of the sky is just so fortunate. It is really an area that has to do with luck and windfalls and heart and what it is your heart really wants. And with Jupiter here, you're going to expand your pathway towards it. If you want some very powerful and very valuable insights into what this is going to mean for you, well, you don't have to wait too long. It is going to be right around Christmas Day that we are going to have a solar eclipse. Now, the ancients believed that the sun meeting Jupiter in the sky was the luckiest day of the year, but this is a solar eclipse meeting Jupiter in the sky, which adds that much more uh, possibility, that much more surprise to the luck that does show up for you now. Having Jupiter in a part of the sky having to do with luck and then such a surprisingly lucky solar eclipse, well, it does tell me that you are set up wonderfully to feel as if life is delighting you and life is able to deliver some really lovely blessings into your life around this time. Blessings that awaken you on a level of heart, on a level of creativity, certainly, on a level of fertility as well. Now, where it comes to matters of love, I do think that eclipse this month is going to be such a powerful symbol for you for feeling as if out of nowhere, your heart has been awakened through a flirtation. If you're open to meeting someone new, it is important not to like try to work with this energy. That's the thing with eclipses is that it's not about putting your intention out there. It's a lot more about being receptive. And that is how the universe is able to bring blessings into your life when you truly are open. So as you move through your life, doing what you're doing, preferably doing something fun that you enjoy, well, it can be love that feels like it just shows up for you. You are getting your flirt on in surprising ways. For those of you who are 
just starting to date somebody, it is so all or nothing around this solar eclipse. Either it'll be with this person that you feel all in and things accelerate, or you will meet somebody else and things start moving in a different direction for you. Now, regardless, know that your heart is feeling very fulfilled at the time of this eclipse in truly surprising ways. For those of you who are in an established bond, it is this eclipse that is all about having fun, enjoying the company of this person. You've got Venus in the same part of the sky for the first three weeks of the month as well. And so it does tell me that you are feeling the love and you are wanting to enjoy your life more with your partner. And chances are, with an eclipse like this, there will be some very surprising moments that allow you to do just that. What I love about this month for you, well, it's got to be Jupiter. I think for all signs now, it is the move of Jupiter and bringing blessings to a new area of life. And for you, what a great area of life to experience blessings now. If there ever was a time for you to truly be open to taking a chance, taking a risk, taking a little bit of a gamble even, and having it pay off wonderfully, that really would be you. Now, of course, don't bet the farm. I always say don't bet the farm. You wanna keep it fun because what it is you do in a spirit of fun now is the one thing or the many things that are the most likely to deliver lovely windfalls for you. Well, thank you so much for watching. You can get a video like this every week by logging on to NadiaShaw.com. Sign up to be one of my superstars. Superstars get expanded exclusive video scopes each and every week, unlimited access to special horoscopes and more. All of this in the superstar space. I look forward to meeting you there. It'll be a great month. Enjoy.